structure lecture series so in last class we have seen how to create a node means how to create a linked list and how to get its data right on the stack memory right today we will see how to make it on heap memory so this was what we have done right i will run this code once again and if you run it will print this linked list right and this is on stack memory right today we will see how to create it on heap memory what i will do i will create a linked list in heap memory right and then i will explain right so same thing i am doing struct node means i am declaring a structure name struct node then integer will be data and integer type data and struct node node and then star next right this will be pointed to the next node right so this structure thing i have already explained in previous lecture right then i will write int main and then i will write return zero just in a case and now struct node i am taking struct node type of pointer right i will take it as head means first node right and then in this head now this is the string in which i i will get the memory from heap malloc right the definition of malloc is in stdlib.h right malloc allocate me the memory on the heap of size so size of right size of function is also in library right size of struct node struct node please allocate me the memory of size this i am telling to my computer and then this head is a pointer so the pointer which i am getting right please convert that pointer this is type casting actually no please the convert that pointer into struct node type of pointer right that's what i have done what i have done i have taken a ask computer to allocate me memory of size of struct node means size of that structure which user has defined and give me pointer to that right and that pointer is means that address is stored in the head right now you see i can store head head dot data right when it is a pointer we will take arrow so this will automatically make it as arrow and it is data is 20 right and head dot next now next i want it to point some other means second node of the linked list right for timing i will keep it as null right since i have not pointed it because for heap allocation i have to create more nodes like this only so what i will do i will copy this just to make you understand i am just pasting it again and again means there are better way to doing it head then there will be say second node second store this reference to second then there is third node third store this reference to third and then there is fourth node fourth fourth and store this reference to fourth right and every node right second also will have data and memory part so what i will do i will do this thing right i have taken four nodes just i have written repeatedly so that you can understand this thing i am doing now what i am giving head dot data is this head dot next is second point to the second memory location that location is in this pointer itself right and then same thing now second second right you we usually we write with arrow second data is say 30 and 
its next second dot uh, next so I will point it to third and then third dot data is equal to say 11 right and third dot next equal to say fourth since we are like right and fourth dot data fourth dot data is equal to say 33 and fourth dot next is equal to null right right so uh, someone might get a doubt like what is the difference between previous lectures link list and this lecture there is very huge difference actually other one is on stack memory this is in heap memory in stack memory when function got out we lose the references this will not be the case here so first i will make it here right i will explain it and then uh, on the tab i will explain what is happening actually yeah so say if you want to print the nodes right so what i will do i will take one more node which will take the first nodes address and print it right means head node address right so this will be the basic structure how to do it fine replicate with what we did in last class right i will take one mode struct node say star p is a pointer right and this p will take head value first node value since head is already creating uh, taking an address so just simply what i will do while p and p next is not equal to null not equal to null means till it le reaches last node printf printf and just backslash t percent d and print the link list right so p data right and keep on moving p equal to p next right keep on moving the node right yeah this will also will not give us last node address if you want that also just simply print it outside to show you right so let's see how the link list is being printed here right 20 30 11 33 right i will just clear the terminal and show it again so this is the same thing which we have done already right this is backslash n so that this percentage sign should not trouble you and yeah right this is the same thing which we have done but there is one difference in that sense in stack memory we could not call it in a function now what i am doing going to do i will just remove all these things right right and i am simply writing a function name display and it will take head as an argument this thing you cannot do in stack memory because function to function once function is out all the references will be swiped out actually right so display i have written now i am declaring this function display for timing i am writing it uh okay so i will write just wide display now this display is taking struct node type of struct node type of pointer so struct node star head or star first just to differentiate the name right and then just I'm copying it to another pointer struct node and star p now while p dot next
next is not equal to null and then printf print the link list with backslash t percentage d give me p and data right print p is equal to p for next right and yeah so just to display it right so still is this will not give so i will clear the code is almost complete yeah so in here right i have declared struct node i have not taken the ref reference of it right p should be pointing to same location where this first is pointing right now and since it is return so i will say return zero right since it is a void function let's run it see 20 30 11 last node has not printed to print last node just print it outside because we are checking the reference first so if i run it yeah 23 right 20 30 11 33 right to make the percent thing so i will show it in next line so I will clear the window and now again we will run it right yeah 20 30 11 33 right so this is the difference in stack and heap memory right what we can call a function we are passing a pointer reference and we are with the point passing the pointing pointer reference we are just traversing through the linked list we are talking about very important concept that is how to pass pointer reference right so since we have completed this program with the help of this only i will show you right so this is the program to create a node right what i will do i will cut it right and i am writing a function named get node get uh, list get list this will give you link list right and i'm just pasting it here it will create a link list and i will return head first node of the link list right from where it is starting so this is a pointer of type struct node right so struct node star right this is the type which it will be returning right so usually people are confused this function only returns a value in this i am passing a pointer returning a pointer now what i need to do how i need to call it i will create a struct node type of pointer for local reference so i will take the name with different star h right and in h i will store get node so this get node function get list sorry get list function what it will do it will give me the reference of first head nodes list whenever you call it and this head this h i will pass in display function right so now my program has become this much small actually right what is the benefit of this get list function every time you can re reuse in fact you can create a header file also which i have created already node create .h. first we'll see whether it is working or not right i will run code right see it is working perfectly fine 20 30 11 13 right so this is how we pass a reference right pointer reference to a function there are very difficult names given in the programming to these things right this is very easy to do anyway if you are logically correct now this thing you cannot do in with stack memory right without malloc function you will not be able to do it because these things require def separate reference which is on heap memory right so that's why people get confused lot in here a lot right now what what i have already done see now you have to call this function every time whenever you need a list and this is for display i will be doing lot of things to reverse in english means lot of interview question of microsoft and google and all right that i will be doing 
फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू शुड बी क्लियर अबाउट दीज कॉन्सेप्ट राइट एंड दिस इज ए बिट हाइडर फाइल आई हैव क्रिएटेड सेम थिंग आई हैव डन राइट सेम थिंग आई हैव डन राइट गिव लिस्ट एंड ऑल दीज थिंग्स राइट बस जस्ट आई हैव क्रिएटेड ए हाइडर फाइल वेन एक्सेसिंग इट यू हैव टू कॉल मीन्स इंक्लूड नोट डॉट एच यू कैन ईजिली use display and give list functions right so this we will see in next lectures i will explain a bit more how to do differencing first you should be thorough about this concept right so thank you very much and bye bye i have created a algorithm lecture for uh, binary search so that code also i will be implementing here right so just uh, look on the playlist of binary search right so thank you bye bye